Hello everyone. Today, I'll demonstrate how to install C6. Fog caching C6 can accommodate 6 minions and consists of a tank and a dry cooler. Let's proceed with the step-by-step -step demonstration of the installation process. The C6 tank and dry cooler are packaged into wooden boxes. Upon receiving the shipment, the first step is to unpack and inspect both the tank and dry cooler for any damage. If you find any damage, please contact us immediately. Next, let me introduce the components of the tank and dry cooler to you. OLED screen, universal wheel, power port C14, outlet, inlet, wires hole, outlet, inlet, temperature sensor, EC fan. Our product includes the following accessories. You can verify whether your accessories are complete based on the provided images. If you require a PDU, for caching offers the specifications, three-phase PDU and single-phase PDU for you to choose from. Apart from that, you also need to prepare the following accessories. Please note that before the formal installation, it's crucial to pre-select the installation location. We recommend Place the dry cooler outdoors with the fan facing outward. Maintain sufficient space at least 50 cm in length between the fan and the wall. If the distance between the dry cooler and the tank exceeds 5 meters, custom hoses will be required. It is recommended to keep the hoses under 10 meters. Ideally, the height difference between the dry cooler and the tank should not exceed 3 meters, as exceeding this limit may impact cooling efficiency. Next, retrieve the handle from the accessory bag and install it on the top cover of the tank for easy handling. With the location fixed, retrieve the gasket and oil pipe S from the accessories, place the gasket at the pipe joints, then Connect the fittings on top of the tank with the interfaces on the bottom of the dry cooler and the fittings on the bottom of the tank with the interfaces on the top of the dry cooler. Following that, take out the clean mining rigs and attach the handles provided in the accessories to the fan locations. Place the mining rigs inside the tank. Next, we will start by installing the PDU. Choose a three-phase or single-phase PD based on your input voltage. Then, use your provided power cord to connect the mining machine to the PD when insert the network cable into the mining machine. Next, we use the C13 plugs of tank and dry cooler to connect to the sockets respectively. Ensure the voltage is set to 200 to 240 volts and the frequency to 50 divided by 60 Hz. After completing the power connections, assemble the pump from the accessories and power it up. To quickly eliminate air, you can first pour coolant into the overflow groove of the tank, then fill the main tank with coolant until the liquid submerges the ASICs. Next, Click the button on the screen and the system will enter the self-check program. During this process, some coolant will enter the pipes and dry cooler causing the liquid level to gradually decrease. At this point, you need to replenish coolant into the overflow groove until the liquid covers the mining machine. Once this is done, the internal circulation debugging of the tank is complete. It is important to note that if the pump is running without fluid, you should manually open the exhaust valve until coolant flows out of it. Then close the exhaust valve or coolant will leak from it. After configuring the mining pool on the PC, click the Start Mining button. Once the mining machine is started, the screen will display the current coolant temperature and mining status. Long press the screen button to halt the cycle of the tank. Up to this point, the installation of C6 is complete. Insert the network cable into the Ethernet port located below the LED screen on the PDU. 
choose DHCP mode and access the IP address displayed on the LED screen. This allows for data viewing and power management through the LED screen interface. The C6 features a fan controller to adjust the system, employing a spray design PID temperature control system. It offers optional AC mode, smart mode, and FC mode, professional mode. AC mode, smart mode automatically controls the fan speed, maintaining the outlet temperature of the water tank at a constant temperature factory default 45 degrees Celsius, maintenance error 0, 5 degrees Celsius. FC mode, professional mode forcibly adjusts the fan speed ratio 1 to 99, with the fan rotating at the minimum speed at 1 and reaching the maximum speed at 99. Mode adjustments can be made based on the indications on the video screen.